The film you are about to see tells the story of the United States Army Parachute Rigger. This soldier is one of the most important factors in the security of the United States. For in the final analysis, the ability of our country to respond in a matter of hours to deliver troops and supplies to any trouble spot in the world depends on his skilled hands and alert mind. The greatest demonstration of confidence has been made by thousands and thousands of paratroopers the moment they made their very first jump. This is the making of the rigger, the man in the red cap. The lives of these men may well depend on you. That is, if you're a U.S. Army parachute rigger. As a parachute rigger, you often jump with the men whose parachutes you have packed. As they land safely, you feel a deep pride. You know that the way you rig the heavy equipment is a major factor in deciding whether or not it will be delivered safely. Yes, your job demands a lot of know-how, attention to detail, and just plain sweat. But most of all, it requires training. As you think about it, memory takes you back to where it all began, to the start of your basic airborne training at Fort Benning, Georgia. Although you aren't aware of it at the time, volunteering for airborne training is a necessary preliminary to becoming a U.S. Army parachute rigger. They toughen you up by making you run until you think you can't run anymore. Then suddenly you discover inner physical resources you never knew you had. 